there's a lot of overlap, especially in the pre-design and design phase with the design team. How can we differentiate between the CXA responsibilities and the design team responsibilities? It's important that we do draw a distinct line between the design team's responsibilities and ours as the commissioning provider. The engineer of record, the architect of record, they are there to design the building based on design intent through the programming phase of the, of the building and the project. We as a commissioning agent during pre-design, for example, we'll start there with the development of the OPR. We can have a, a very big impact as a commissioning provider in developing the OPR and helping both the owner and the design team uh, develop the design intent. That is the objective. However, we are not there to design the building. During the design um, with load calculations, equipment selection, for example, um, the design team, that is what they have been hired to do and, and that is their scope of work. We as commissioning providers are there to provide our lessons learned and to provide any issues that may come up as a result of the load calculations or the equipment selection moving forward.